the future used to be so clear when I was reliving the past. Once I caught up to the moment I had left, that ended. All I've had to go on since then are the plan and the visions. I knew Jack would come to me. I'd seen that, but I didn't know why exactly or how it would end. There he is. You are right. My visions of the future aren't always clear, but they don't lie. Speaking of lies, Joyce is saying he's discovered his brother's time machine. We've spent 17 years looking for it, and he finds it in less than a day? Does sound unlikely. Still, we know it's out there somewhere, and we don't know what his brother managed to tell him. If he really has located the machine, why would he come here and tell you? Smart Money says he's trying to play you. Maybe, but the machine is out there. It's in our interest to find out where. And if Jack knows, I have to talk to him. Dr. Joyce could have provided the answer to that question. William's attitude and knowledge made him a liability. Is that angry young man going to cooperate any more than his brother did? You remember Jack as a close friend, but that clouds your judgment. Don't make this personal. It's not. But don't forget why we're here tonight. After what happened, our people need reassurance that we're in control. You're the man who could win them over. Let me handle Joyce, so you can concentrate on your speech. I know what's at stake here, Martin. And here you are. I had to see the lifestyles of the sick and traitorous up close and personal. And it was such a nice invitation. How do you want to deal with this, Paul? I could still try to reach Jack and make him see reason. Or I could let Hatch deal with him so nothing would distract me from leading Monarch. Up into the past, I've tried to change things. Answer me this question, Paul. I once trusted Jack more than anybody. It was my only chance to make him understand the truth. The fuck do you mean nobody got a look at the shooter? Without me there to give the speech, my empire would start to crumble like a house of cards. I believe that with hope comes miscalculation. And as you and I are well aware, Mr. George, with miscalculation can often come catastrophe. And that leaves me with you, Mr. Joyce. But my old friend would be a lost cause dead and buried, along with the rest of my past. Tonight is a celebration, a celebration in face of darkness. Tonight we celebrate because I promise to you that we are prepared. Monarch would grow stronger with my presence. The plan would go forward as intended. We didn't come this far to get derailed now. You talk to him, find out what he knows. Then get rid of him. You're all heart money bags. I know you want to make this all about you and me, Jack. But that's far away in the past now. And I have a speech to prepare for. seen where this leads. I've been to the end of time, and I've escaped it, all the way to 1999, when it all started. I've tried to change things, but by trying, I only made them happen in the first place.
Security was tight at the Monarch Gala. You took quite a risk walking into the lion's den. If we were going to kidnap Dr. Amaral, then we needed to do it from the inside. Beth Wilder. You were quick to trust her. We had common interests. Is that all you had? That's all we needed. Thanks for showing up. Here, I thought this was going to be a rescue. Right, there's a story here. You know a guy called Hatch? Serene's right-hand man. He was here. He gave me this big speech about how he wants to take down Paul. I hope you said no. I didn't trust him for a second. He set me loose anyways, told me to wait for an opening. I just gave you one. Appreciate it. What's it look like out there? I think you're secure. Everyone's concentrating on the party. So far, your crazy plan's working. And Dr. Emeril? I don't have a fix on her. She's either at the party or at her office at the R&D facility here on the island. I'll scout out the party. So you're gonna sip champagne while I break into a high security installation. It's like you got this all figured out. I'll save you a cocktail, weenie. Oh, well, in that case, My cover isn't going to survive the night, but it'll last a little longer, so you can't walk out the front door with me. This is the quickest way to the R&D facility. I disabled the security at the back door, but there'll be guards. Contact me when you're clear. And Jack, you know what's at stake here. This can't be about revenge. I'm not here for Paul. in the morning. My powers were growing. I was learning to control them better. That felt good. Who the hell designs these doors? Okay, I'm gonna have to move faster to get through. Hey, Beth, I'm clear. What's next? You'll see a radar tower up ahead of Oh, you could have warned me about that one, Beth. Okay. How am I getting to that radar tower? <clears throat> Up you go. Try this again. All right. Hey, it was.
was just our people there. We can spin it however we want. Time felt broken here. The timeline of the old cannon felt loose. I could shift it around. Smart place to aim the cannon, guys. Monarch projections say these stutters are getting more frequent. If one hits while we're grabbing Dr. Amaral... You'll be frozen. Yeah, I know. It's a risk. Monarch specialist troopers have the stutterproof gear. I bet Dr. Amaral would have that in her office, too. Can't I'll keep an eye out. See if I grab it for you. That's great. Beth. Beth? I'm at the radar tower. Where's the lab? Below your feet. It's all top secret. The elevator inside will take you down. Oh, seriously? What is this, a Bond villain layer? You have no idea. Just don't fall into the shark tank. Thank you. And welcome. Tonight marks a momentous occasion. For years, we have been building... Speech is streaming. Today. Let's give years Monarch the audience they deserve. ...developing, training. For me personally, this marks the end of a 17-year journey, and today we emerge from the shadows. We do so accepting great responsibility. I present to you the CFR. The Cronon Field Regulator. This device has been at the heart of our Cronon research since 2010, but I am here to assure you that it is so much more than just that. This device will Beth, be I'm about to take the elevator. I see Paul still fond of his own voice? Yeah, he's talking about his survival plan. The crowd's eating it up.
getting Shit. more frequent. That was some kind of surveillance drone. Knowing that Monarch had eyes in the sky made me a little uneasy. What the hell is this? The device drained my powers. We refer to it as a chronon dampener. Serene ordered Hatch to kill me because he didn't want to put the plan at risk. And seeing the scale of that facility, I started realizing just how deep that plan went. It made me wonder. Time was ending. What was it all for? Where's Amron's office? Be able to get out from here. Let's try that again.
guessing this isn't the usual employee route. Looks like nobody here knows about the mess I made on the way in. <sighs> nice job, Beth. That's Emerald's office. There looks like what Beth wanted. Oh shit. Emerald's at the party. The stutter won't last. I better find a way out of here and get to the party. Quite expensive piece of tech you stole. Bill me. I knew Beth's cover wouldn't last long. Had to get it to her at the party before it was too late. Sounds like the way out of this place. All I had to do was make it through the garage. Seems simple enough.
Something's not gonna make my life any easier. There's gotta be a way out of here. Damn. You almost must have locked everything down. Talking about. Beth, I got that device for you, but Dr. Amaral's at the party. Yeah, I just spotted her. Yeah, save me that cocktail, Weenie. I'll make my way there. Serene's finished his speech, and he knows you're loose. He's headed your way. Remember what we said. I'll keep him occupied, but switch to the Monarch frequency to make sure you stay out of his crosshairs. Beth, I've got company. Let's get the party. That's the last of them. That's the last of them. Exact coordinates for Joyce ASAP. Monarch Actual is moving in to intercept. This is home guard five. Just spotted him entering the tunnel system outside the party grounds. Huh. Again. I could see the mansion where the gala was. I had to find a way to get there. I could see the energy field of another monarch chronon damper. It would drain my powers. I'd have to find a way to shut it off. My powers won't work within that sphere. I better be careful. Yeah. 
security's tight. Maybe you want to shut that machine off. Somebody get Serene back here! You were headed for the party. What was your plan? I needed to get to Dr. Amaral before the stutter ended and Monarch found out I was coming. There's gotta be a way to get past that gate. should be here somewhere. Need to get to her before the stutter ends. Mr. Serene's speech had been a success. The world was falling apart, but the wine and cheese crowd was enjoying their little goddamn soiree. Beth was key to pulling off the mission. I needed to get to her before going any further.
easy, easy, easy. Hey. It's okay. It's me. Jesus. Look at all this. Oh, this is your style. These people have no idea I've been shooting up half a Paul's little amusement park. Yeah, well, Monarch does. I think my cover's gonna last. Yeah, well, I don't think it would do much good for the next part anyway. Okay, Dr. Amaral somewhere inside the mansion. Let's go grab her. Bit of luck, we can be gone before anybody notices. Okay, lead the way. What's our plan once we grab her? There's a boat dock right outside the mansion. Okay, we can make that work. place at the wrong time, literally. before time kicks back in and that drone turns us into paste. Let's get to it, Doctor.
Need to open that gate. What about you? You're clear. Go. I can swing by go. and... No. Just go. We went to all this trouble to grab her. Beth, I'm counting on you to keep her alive. I'll make my own way out. My plan was simple. There was a bridge to the mainland. To fight my way through anything Monarch would throw at me and steal a car. Drive it back to the swimming pool. Clear. See how it shakes out. Beth and Dr. Am are all clear, it was time for me to get gone. For that, I needed wheels. Valet parking. Beloved by 